Well, I'm back from the gig. Pretty good gig. There's Mr. Hank. He's visiting till tomorrow. Mr. Jack has just had a nice bath at the beauty parlor. He's waiting for his buddy Dottie to come visit him. You ready? Look how pretty he is. He's all shiny and everything. Stand by, we're getting ready to hit the road. Shut up, Hank. Says we got 178 miles to go. Be there at 428. We got the doggy crate in the back with a new doggy bed in it. And lots of doodads. Damn by. Well, the afternoon tunnel traffic is causing havoc my journey north. It's not unusual though, so there's no big deal. I figured we'd have it. You can see there's no waves on the bay today. Fort Wool coming up on the right. You've seen that from the night gig when I'm going across the tunnel. A lot of sailboats sailing around. I don't see many people fishing like I thought I would. This is hot striper territory right here. Some other kind of snafus got us now. We're outside of, on the edge of Newport News. <coughs> We're just bumping along here. Trees are starting to turn pretty good up here. We got 60 miles to go now. There's a rest area right there. They're off the main road now. All country. Lots of buzzards. I call them boozards. Beautiful neck of the woods. Look at that big farm right there. Ooh, that might be the winery. The sign said there was a winery up here. Hartwood Winery. Yeah, that's got to be it. Some stakes are for the. Probably the new part of the winery. Interesting. Some beautiful homes, farms down through this way. Hartwood Road. This is a, a bet on some really good relic hunting. I know there was something I was going to share with you and I forgot about it. I took my uh, sharpening vest over to the guru to fix it, snap on it, but I broke the snap off, so he put a new snap on my uh, apron, I should say, not a vest, apron. And he said, yeah, look at this coin I found. I said, I don't know when I found it, but I found it in all my chains the other day when I was digging, cleaning it up. You can see it's got, come back here, 1936 on it. It's uh, a lady sitting maybe holding a spear. has one penny on it. Guru don't know what it is and of course I haven't been in home to look it up on the internet. It's about the size of a large set, maybe a little larger. It's got a lot of writing on the back, but it looks like it's in Danish or I'm not sure what it is. And I'll put a better picture of it when I get to stop bouncing around somewhat. You'll be able to see what it is, see if you can tell what it is. I can't tell what the, what's on the back of it. If there's a design, it looks like a man's head to me. But it don't have to be. Yeah, it is a man's head. Okay, stand by. We'll get back to that later. That is a modern day silo next to an old silo. Look at that thing. Looks like a air it's about to be an aircraft. Turn right on Elk Run Road. Hell's Run Road. We've got to turn right at one mile. Ten miles to go. Ten miles. One mile to go. Well we made it. Stand by. Yeah. 
she's really shy and scary took us a half hour to get to the sofa hold on guys there you go good girl We're inside with the voice. Hanks, like I said, visiting. He's going home tomorrow. Come on, Hank. Say hi. Hi, Daddy. Come on, Daddy. Come on. Come on out with the boy. Well, it's a little after seven and we're up. She's eating her breakfast. Big old Jack is watching. Supervisor. Very, very scared of noises. The electric door knock, knocks when, the, when it unlocks. That scares her. But she's uh, much better, even today, than she was last night. Said I'm hungry. It's a big old Jack. What are you doing? His bullhead Hank. <laughs> you hear that? That's everybody eating. Hank, get out of the way. I'm just checking her oil. Checking his <laughs> now she's in Jack's bowl. She says, I think that's better than what I got. But it's empty. <laughs> God, bad luck. Another empty bowl. I'm going to go back in my bowl. It's got food in it. Jack's going to check my oil again. She got through eating, she went right over and picked up Hank's ball. Look at her. Said, I like balls. I think. I like this one anyway. Look at that ball. Oh man, I like it. She's trying to eat the stuffing off of it. We're going to have to take that away from you. No, Hank. Hank. No. No. That's not your food. You already ate yours. No. Everybody's going outside. We're going to see if he goes out with the boys. Come on. Come on. Hank's Come on. going out. Jack's out. But am I going out? Come on. I don't know. Come on. I'm thinking. Come on. I'm halfway out. That door makes a lot of noise clicking like that.
Well, we're out. She heard a dog bark. I can see Jack's going to lose a lot of weight. Ah, the first ball. Jack. <laughs> Alligator. Two alligators. I'm inside fixing my first cup of coffee. <laughs> she likes Jack's balls. No, it's all checking down. I don't know if you can see it or not, but she's got one of Jack's bones, a red big plastic bone that belongs to Jack. There. Well, I like it. It's a nice big bone, she said. Mmm. My favorite. Okay, I'm going to end this video now. Get ready for another one. Stand by everybody, we're having a good day.